Welcome to the Five on Five. Joining us today is Ryan Chackle here to talk about the classic. Now, for those who are familiar, what is the classic? Um, it's a two-day event. It's July 15th and 16th. Uh, the whole thing is at Centennial Golf Club. Uh, we started this concept, gosh, 11 years ago in Bend in Central Oregon, which it's now grown into be the largest golf and culinary event in the state. Um, so we've brought the same concept down here to Centennial. So on Friday, you have a golf tournament. We have about 40 to 50 teams competing um, in an 18-hole tournament at Centennial. And the next night, we call the main event. It's called the Classic Feast. Um, we're expecting over 1,000 people. We're already over 900 so far. Um, but we feature, your ticket gets you in the gate. We feature 12 chefs, 11 wineries, um, spirits, cocktails, uh, silent auction, and a dance band. Um, so it goes from 4 to 11 p.m. at the event lawn at Centennial. Uh, but it's a two-day event, and it's a wonderful time, and the whole thing is for charity. How does it work for the public? Can they mm -hmm. come and watch some of the golfers? Can they just come to the feast? Do you buy it for two days? How does it all work? Um, we don't really get people watching uh, for the golf tournament. Um, they're either so, eating or they're golfing. Correct, yeah, <laughs> yeah. And they can, you know, we even get people signing up as an individual. So if you want to come play in the golf tournament and you don't have a foursome or a team, we can put you with a team. Okay. Um, we do that regularly. If you want to just come to the dinner Saturday night, which is what the vast majority of people do, you're more than welcome to do that. So there's tickets for either or packages for both. Um, but the dinner is, is really the, the, the special part of the weekend. And you touched on this just a bit. You said and it's all for charity. Talk about it that. Is, it is. Uh, the, the Classic's a 501c3, so it's a nonprofit. 100% of our net proceeds we donate to the two charities here in Rogue Valley, um, CASA of Jackson County and the Resolve Center uh, for Dispute Resolution, and we give the money to those two charities. Uh, so everything we're doing is for a great cause, but we like to have a good time in the midst of it. Uh, put on a really good event and showcase the culinary expertise that exists here. Talk a little bit about that. What are we talking about when we say the feast? I'm not a golfer oh my myself, but I mean, when you say the feast, my ears, they perk up a little it's, bit. It's unique. I mean, uh, there, there's a, I know there's a lot of culinary events. There's, there's everything under the stars, but um, this, is, this is pretty special. People are really decked out. Uh, again, you are outside. We have a lot of shade tents, so don't worry about that. Uh, you wander from booth to booth. So a chef gets their own tent and uh, their team is there making it on site. You get to see it, interact with them um, across the table, and they hand out bite-sized portions. And you can go through as much as you want, which wow. happens. Yeah, you find something that, Yeah, you find something you love. I mean, we've had Kobe beef and everything else. You find something you love, and you'll, you'll go back and see that chef multiple times. But we want you to sample all 12. Wow. And then there's the wineries. So go experience and interact with uh, the wineries and chat with them about what they're pouring. Uh, the cocktails and spirits are the same way. We have dogwood distillers on site. Uh, so it's really a culinary feast, right? yeah. it implies. Um, come hungry and come thirsty. Absolutely. Your ticket gets you in and it gets you everything you want. Um, okay. So we do hope you go into the silent auction tent and find some items or packages. We have trips to Mexico and Vegas Wow. Um, in there and even down to gift certificates to local restaurants because we are trying to raise money for charity. Right. Um, and then the dance band starts about 7 o'clock that night and okay. runs to 11. Well, we've got much more to talk about. We're going to take a quick break. We'll be right back. Welcome back. Joining us once again is Ryan Shackle here to talk about the classic and the feast. We're talking about a golf tournament and a delicious culinary experience yep. that's all for charity. Thanks so much for being here. Yeah, absolutely. Thanks for having me. So for those who are interested in either the golf portion or the feast, talk to us about registration and how they get tickets. Uh, our website. It's pretty, it's pretty simple. Uh, you buy tickets to the website. Uh, the foursomes right now are 1800 or 1200 That comes with dinner tickets, tables. The whole nine yards. Um, and individual dinner tickets right now are $75. Uh, at the gate, they will be 100 so there is a incentive to buy them ahead of time. But you can buy them all online. Uh, we send you a welcome kit and a packet that talks about a tire, where to park, uh, and everything else. So it's pretty easy. And where can we get that website? SouthernOregonClassic.com. Excellent. Is there anything that I didn't touch on, Ryan, that no. you want to add? Thank you for sponsoring. Appreciate you guys' support. And the dates, one more time. Uh, July 15th and 16th, Friday and Saturday up at Centennial. Excellent. Brian, thanks yeah. so much for being Thank here. Thank you. Appreciate it. We'll be right back.